seventh grade, lesson 14. This one is on problems about parts of a whole. Now, if we have um, a part plus another part, it equals the whole, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, that's what you're going to be learning about today. So, a part plus another part equals a whole, just a W right there, like that. Okay, so write that equation down. Okay, part plus part equals a whole. Okay, now listen to this problem. Example one. One third of the bicycles were on sale. Okay, they tell me one third of the bikes were on sale. Okay, then it says this. What fraction of the bikes were not on sale? Well, this is pretty simple. If one third is on sale, then how much is not on sale? Two thirds. Two thirds. Okay, because a whole makes up three thirds. So if one plus two equals three whole. Okay, now let's go a little bit harder. Okay, um, let's look at this next problem. Sam was excited that 61% of his answers were correct. What percent of his answers were not correct? Well, what is a complete percentage amount? 100. 100%. So, if he got 61% that was correct, that's part, plus another part equals the whole. So, how much is not correct? Um, how would I work this problem? Well, you can do 100 minus 61. You're exactly right. Because we need something smaller than that 100 to take 61 plus something equal 100. You need it to be a smaller number. So, we're going to subtract. Very good. And when we subtract 100 minus 61, we get 39. So, what percent of his answers were not right? 39. 39%. All right? That's lesson 14.